how are the preparations for Maya 3 going on? Oh, very nice, very, very nice. And uh, although there is, I mean, most of it has already been prepared for mm. me. As you can see, I'm wearing a suit and there's a full wardrobe that is full of suits. It's a different look altogether. Yeah. How do you connect to your character in Maya 3? Like what drew you to, you know, work for this character in the series? Okay, to be very honest, uh, what drew me to it was, uh, number one, um, the way it was written. Okay. You know, the, the whole language of it, how it was presented on paper and even the dialogues, the spoken words, the things that I'm saying, they're so beautifully written. And that little bit of a love story that remains hidden uh, in this otherwise tabooed franchise, you know, if, if I can say that for the lack of a better word. So I was quite thinking, you know, within my mind that so many times I used to ask Krishna that, should I do this or would it look okay or should I not or really, you know, all of those things. And that just added to whatever little discomfort this man faces, yeah. you know, during the plot. So you were like personally even going through it, like Absolutely. You know, in your head? Like. Yes, yes, of course, yeah, because I have a daughter, yeah. right, and she's, yeah, so she's old enough now and I, you know, the, whatever that little reservation you yeah. have uh, with the age factor, so that I guess was uh, pretty much the, the need of the script or the need of this role, yeah. which came across naturally, I guess. So you started off your career like a major blockbuster film that was Dastak was yeah. with Vikram Bhatt and now today yeah. you're being directed by her daughter. So how has, what's like the entire vibe, how has the... Well I was just telling her the other day that I've worked with all three generations in a family, like I'm that vintage. <laughs> but, uh, uh, but yeah, it's a, it's a brilliant feeling, it's so beautiful. Because uh, when I was working with Vikram, it, it's been a long association, yeah. it was in 1996 and with Vikram and Bhatt Saab. And then I kept working with Vikram for quite some time for other things and Krishna was not, I mean Krishna must have been a toddler at that yeah. time. And then finally in Creature when I was again working with Vikram, Krishna probably started coming to the sets and started working and at that time she was uh, just about very young and she was an assistant and she was doing her father's job and all of that, this and that. And that time I remember we used to hang out in a place in Uti which had these French windows, it was a small little cafe and that one of those evenings she told me while all of us were having a drink, she said that, you know Mukul sir, if I ever make something, I'm going to take you in it. And I took it like, okay, yeah, she's saying it, but then you know, a lot of people say that and then that's exactly what happened, so yeah. I'm the common, the highest common factor in our entire generation, I guess, like the HCF kind of thing, and that's what I am. Thank you so much, Mukul. It was a pleasure having you here. Thank you. Would you like to like say something to your something to your fans who are yes, going to watch Maya? Yes. So sure. this is truly a, a fantastic story, Maya Three, that's coming up. It's a love story with a unique sort of a twist in it. And if I was you, I'd probably not miss it ever. <laughs> <laughs>